Happy Sabbath, everyone. This week, we'll be studying Lesson 5, and we'll be studying the conversion of Paul. The memory text for today is, Go! This man is my chosen instrument to proclaim my name to the Gentiles and their kings and to the people of Israel. Acts 9.15 The conversion of Saul of Tarsus, who became Paul, was one of the most remarkable events in the history of the Apostolic Church. The importance of Paul, however, goes way beyond the conversion itself, for Paul is certainly not the only enemy of the church to have become a genuine Christian. The issue instead relates to what he ended up doing for the sake of the gospel. Paul had been an incorrigible opponent to the early believers, and the harm he could have done to the infant church was enormous. He had both determination and a, the official support to destroy the church, yet he responded faithfully to God's call on the road to Damascus and became the greatest of all the apostles. From among the most bitter and relentless persecutors of the Church of Christ arose a blessed, a defender and most successful herald of the gospel. Ellen G. White, Sketches from the Life of Paul, page 9. Paul's previous action in persecuting the early church would always bring him a deep sense of his own unworthiness. Though he could say with a still deeper sense of gratitude that God's grace to him had not been in vain. With Paul's conversion, Christianity changed forever. Study this week's lesson to prepare for Sabbath, August 4th. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you back here tomorrow.